Hi, I'm Carly from Nintendo World Reports. Welcome to Slowpoke News Report, your week in Pokemon Go. Further details of the Pokemon Go Week event in South Korea were posted by the official Pokemon Go Korea Twitter account. There will be increased spawn rates across the country, excluding some areas, increased Pikachu spawns, and during the week of the 10th to 12th of November there will be Articuno, Moltres, Zapdos, and Lugia raids, though these will not take place inside the mall, and also Mr. Mime and Unknown spawns. Niantic Support sent out a tweet about EX Raid feedback. The message simply reads that they are working to improve the invitation system based on what has been heard from trainers. There has been no follow-up as yet. EX Raids are continuing with the majority still taking place in sponsored locations such as Sprint stores in the US. Shiny Dust Girl was released and with it increased spawn points. Remember that Dust Girl spawns more frequently at night and the Shiny model is red. Many have predicted that Shiny Shuppet will also be released in the wild before the event ends. Daylight Savings Time started in Europe this weekend and following on from other locations in the world, the same one hour shift to raid times has been observed. This means your raid start one hour earlier and also finish one hour earlier. That's all for Slowpoke News Report this week. Tune in again to NWR TV and check out all our articles on NintendoWorldReport.com. Bye bye!